If you know the enemy and know yourself, you need not fear the results of a hundred battles. Let your plans be dark and impenetrable as night, and when you move, fall like a thunderbolt. Even the finest sword plunged into salt water will eventually rust. Appear weak when you are strong, and strong when you are weak. The supreme art of war is to subdue the enemy without fighting. Victorious warriors win first and then go to war, while defeated warriors go to war first and then seek to win. All warfare is based on deception. Know thyself, know thy enemy. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. In the midst of chaos, there is also opportunity. Strategy without tactics is the slowest route to victory. Tactics without strategy is the noise before defeat. A leader leads by example, not by force. Opportunities multiply as they are seized. To know your enemy, you must become your enemy. The wise warrior avoids the battle. In war, then, let your great object be victory, not lengthy campaigns. The greatest victory is that which requires no battle. He who is prudent and lies in wait for an enemy who is not will be victorious. Move swift as the wind and closely formed as the wood. Attack like the fire and be still as the mountain. Treat your men as you would your own beloved sons, and they will follow you into the deepest valley. He will win who knows when to fight and when not to fight. There is no instance of a nation benefiting from prolonged warfare. He will win whose army is animated by the same spirit throughout all its ranks. To win one hundred victories in one hundred battles is not the acme of skill. To subdue the enemy without fighting is the acme of skill. Speed is the essence of war. Take advantage of the enemy's unpreparedness. Travel by unexpected routes and strike him where he has taken no precautions. The expert in battle moves the enemy and is not moved by him. The opportunity of defeating the enemy is provided by the enemy himself. When the enemy is relaxed, make them toil. When full, starve them. When settled, make them move. There are roads which must not be followed, armies which must not be attacked, towns which must not be besieged, positions which must not be contested, commands of the sovereign which must not be obeyed. Who wishes to fight must first count the cost. Rouse him and learn the principle of his activity or inactivity. Force him to reveal himself so as to find out his vulnerable spots. If the mind is willing, the flesh could go on and on without many things. We cannot enter into alliances until we are acquainted with the designs of our neighbors. The more we sweat in peace, the less we bleed in war. In peace, prepare for war. In war, prepare for peace. The art of war is of vital importance to the state. In the practical art of war, the best thing of all is to take the enemy's country whole and intact. To shatter and destroy it is not so good. When you surround an army, leave an outlet free. Do not press a desperate foe too hard. The general who wins the battle makes many calculations in his temple before the battle is fought. 
there are not more than five musical notes. Yet the combinations of these five give rise to more melodies than can ever be heard. Water shapes its course according to the nature of the ground over which it flows. The soldier works out his victory in relation to the foe whom he is facing. When you see the correct course to take, act. Do not wait for orders. If you wait by the river long enough, the bodies of your enemies will float by. It is easy to love your friend, but sometimes the hardest lesson to learn is to love your enemy. There is no greater danger than underestimating your opponent. Be extremely subtle, even to the point of formlessness. Be extremely mysterious, even to the point of soundlessness. Thereby, you can be the director of the opponent's fate. The whole secret lies in confusing the enemy, so that he cannot fathom our real intent. Attack is the secret of defense. Defense is the planning of an attack. Great results can be achieved with small forces. An enemy is a friend who knows too much about you. You have to believe in yourself. If quick, I survive. If not quick, I am lost. This is death. The wheels of justice grind slow, but grind fine. You can't trust a man who has nothing to lose. If you ignore both your enemy and yourself, you are certain to be in peril. If his forces are united, separate them. Plan for what is difficult while it is easy. Do what is great while it is small. If he sends reinforcements everywhere, he will be weak everywhere. Beware your enemy is not. Disorder came from order. Fear came from courage. Weakness came from strength. If your friend is friends with your enemy, it means that you should not hang out with this friend. Every animal with blood in its veins and horns on its head will fight when it is attacked. Never trust a friend who is silent about your flaws. Beware of sugar that is mixed with poison. Beware of the fly that sat on a dead snake. One need not destroy one's enemy. One need only destroy his willingness to engage. 